Hello everyone, this is Dr. Chris, Cameron Family Chiropractic. Today's video is on tech tips that'll help you use your technology and not hinder your posture. All right, so we're gonna start off with number one. Did you know that when you're on your phone and you're texting away and your head is forward, you're putting 60 pounds of tension and pressure and force onto all the muscles of your neck, the ligaments, the joints, and most importantly, the spinal cord, all right? That, and you know what, and we're also doing it, research tells us, we're spending on average four hours a day on our devices with our head down. Man, is that ever gonna lead to a problem in the future? We're already seeing it in this younger generation right now, this generation that grew up on devices, we're seeing postural decline and decay and damage in their neck, equivalent to someone who's in their 30s and they're only not even 10 years old yet. This is a crisis which is happening now. So I wanna give you some tips for yourself and your kids on their devices. So number one, when you see your child or yourself or anyone on the street, don't look down at your phone to text. Bring it up to eye level. Look at it at eye level and bring your head up. Not only will it prevent you from damaging your neck, it'll prevent you from running out of that pole or that door. We've all seen it happen. Don't laugh because you know it's happened maybe to you too. Anyway, we've also got those on the phone. You know what? You don't need to be head and head down like this. Use your speaker option or make sure your head is upright like this. Number three, if you're on the phone a lot, use a headset. It'll help your neck uh, immensely. Here's a big one. A big one for parents who have kids that play video games. Don't let them sit on the TV in trance like this with their head forward. Get them to sit back. Get the TV or the computer screen up at a level where they can sit with their head upright, their eyes straight ahead, their neck back, and they can play their game that way. I only let my, my daughter play a game for a little while, but when she's playing, the rule is, if I come by and I see her like this, the game goes off. So she is slowly, but she has learned to have good posture, at least when I'm around. All right, and then the last one, most important one here, most important is don't drive and use a cell phone. Don't be that guy who's texting on the cell phone, trying to get that last minute message in, putting other lives at risk. Don't be that guy. And now, last but not least, our next workshop, our next video is gonna be on how to sit. So proper sitting posture uh, while you're at the computer and the desk. If you like this video and you wanna hear more information on this, then uh, click the link below, which will uh, take you to our PDF uh, posture, which is gonna have seven tips, all seven days of how you can improve your posture day by day by day. I hope this helps, if it is, Press like, share it with someone who, who needs the help, and we look forward to seeing you on our next video.